Waiter, idiot! Wait, come back! You've got my credit card! Mark is so spoiled! He left me with nothing! And he told me I should live in this shack? This is ridiculous! I'm not gonna stand for this! Hey, get out of my way, you homeless idiot! What? I'm not homeless! Yeah, 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 I don't want to hear it. Move aside, alright? I want to continue to enjoy my walk. Ugh, I've got to get home! My parents are gonna be so mad! Mom! Dad! Marcus, where have you been? You were supposed to be home hours ago. I know, but Roger completely left me behind. And he took my card. He has all my money. Now, come on, Marcus. Don't be so ridiculous. Yeah, that sounds like a big lie to me. Roger, get in here. Yeah, what's going on? Marcus has a very interesting story he just told us. Really, is he about to tell you how mean he's been to me? I'm just a victim in all of this. A victim? Are you joking? Marcus, calm down. See, this is what I mean. Look at his temper. You just stole all my money and left me in the city with nothing. I've had enough of this. Marcus, go to your room and stop being so poor. There he is. What is he doing? He's buying a ton of food? This place is really expensive. I need to get my card back. Roger. Uh oh, what are you doing here? I know exactly what you're doing. Give me my card back. Marcus, just let me have this one thing, all right? I just want to have a nice dinner. Get lost. Uh, what seems to be going on over here? This is my brother, and he took my credit card, and he's going to buy all this food with my money. This is technically stealing. You're going to let him pay for the food with stolen money? I mean, he used the card that he brought. I don't know if it's stolen or not. Yeah, this guy doesn't know what he's talking about. Trying to say I stole his money. I just want to go with my food, all right? I'm out of here. Roger, get back here. Give me back my card. Ugh. Well, look, if you keep having money problems, then, I mean, we have an opening position. You can always work here if you need to. Thanks. I appreciate the offer, but I'm going to get my money back one way or another. Happy birthday, Roger. Look at all the presents we got you. Well, look who it is, finally showing up to his brother's birthday party. And if I remember correctly, you didn't even give me anything for my birthday. How am I supposed to buy you gifts, Roger? You have all my money. Here we go with the money issue again. It's just an excuse, man. That's it. Where are you going? Uh, if you're not gonna give me something, then I'm just gonna take one of your things instead. Hey, absolutely not. Yeah, this'll do. Boys, calm down. What is going on up here? Roger's taking my phone. That's what's going on. It's what I deserve. He didn't even give me a gift. This is my phone now. Marcus, you are Roger's older brother. You should be buying him things. Why are you being like this, Roger? What did I ever do to you? We're supposed to be brothers, and you're nothing but a spoiled brat. All right, that is it. I am sick of you two arguing, Roger. Keep the phone. That way, maybe Marcus can learn a lesson. Roger, what are you doing? Are you just here to show off your fancy car again? No, no, man. Look, I, I felt bad about the other day. And I just wanted to apologize and bring you somewhere, all right? Well, where are you taking me? Look, it it's a surprise, all right? I, I actually do genuinely feel really bad about what I did, and I want to make it up to you. Okay, well, then let's get going. the middle of the woods what is there to do out here no no it's right over there you just have to get out of the car to see it all right fine i'm out of the car <laughs> sucker i'm out of here you have got to be kidding me roger oh i can't believe i fell for it and he did it again he just left me in the middle of nowhere how am i gonna get home now oh this is taking forever what you stupid idiot Ugh. Hey, you! Yeah? Do you need help? Yeah, I do. Give me some money. I need to buy a new car. I can't give you any money, sir. My brother stole all of my money, actually. Um, okay, then why haven't you canceled your card? Oh, I just didn't realize it's something I could do. Oh my gosh, that's so stupid. Yeah, of course. I have credit cards canceled on me all the time. Well, man, good luck with your truck and everything. I have to get to town and cancel my card before my brother spends all of my money. What, what are you gonna do? Just leave me here on the side of the road? Yeah, good luck, man. Wait, stop! All right, I've gotta find my wallet. That way it has my ID and I can go and cancel my card. What is going on? Where's my stuff? Where are all my things? Uh <laughs> 
Hey, I didn't expect you to be back so fast. Roger, you jerk. I can't believe you left me out there again. And where's all my stuff? Oh, no, no, no. You don't have any stuff anymore. I sold it off of money. I can't believe you would do this. Roger, what is wrong with you? This is what you get. You should have got me a birthday present. That's it. I, I can't handle this anymore. Enough is enough, Roger. Where do you think you're going, huh? All right. I gotta go in and cancel this card and stop Roger's spending spree once and for all. Excuse me, sir. I need to cancel my card. Whoa, dude, look at these Gucci slides. They're sick. Yeah, we'd like to buy these Gucci slides, please. You do realize those slides are about $1,000 per slide. Oh, so sorry, my bad. I didn't ask, all right? I said I wanted to buy the slides, so let me buy the slides. Wow, who even is this guy? Does he think we're poor? Um, sir, this card has been declined. Uh, no, 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 you're stupid. Uh, just swipe it again. Okay, no, sir, this card is declined. I'm actually supposed to seize this card. No, there's no way that there's not enough money in that card, all right? The store is stupid. It's stupid, I tell you. All right, I've had enough of you two poor people in my store. Get out immediately. I can't believe this. I can't believe he did it. It's all Marcus's fault. Once again, taking something away from me. Makes me look like an idiot in front of my friends. Well, I'm gonna steal from mom and dad, and I'm gonna blame it all on him. <laughs> Let's do this. Piece of cake. Uh, oh, man. Yep, there's his wallet, just as planned, and boom. All right. Roger, what is going on? We got your text. You said it was some kind of emergency? Marcus stole everything. He left the house with all your expensive stuff. What kind of expensive stuff? I don't know. I couldn't see. I, I tried to stop him, but I don't know. I was afraid of what he would do to me. I have had up to here with Marcus and his attitude issues, and now he's stealing from us? I can't believe that. Marcus would never do such a thing. He did. He did, and... We have to do something about it before it's too late. This holiday season, pick up the autographed Shane Plays poster and get access to an exclusive unreleased Shane Plays holiday movie. Watch Finkleberry try to ruin the holidays and see if Shane and Brittany can stop him. Head over to ShanePlays.shop to pick one up today and secure your spot for a never to be released Shane Plays holiday movie. Uh, hey guys. Don't act dumb with us, Marcus. We know exactly what you did. How could you do this to us? I just don't know where we went wrong with him. <laughs> I don't even know what you're talking about. Don't act stupid, Marcus. I saw you do everything. We saw you steal all of our stuff. Your mother's beautiful jewelry, my wallet. What? No, I'd never steal from you guys. I haven't even been home all day. Can't you guys see he's just making this up? Look at your brother's face. Look at how sad he is. Do you honestly think he would lie at a time like this? If you guys can't see that Roger's lying, that's not my fault. I, I can't deal with this anymore. I don't want to be treated like this. I don't deserve it. I'm going off on my own. I have to get out of this rain. Ugh, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to find somewhere to stay. What is that? Some kind of cabin? Well, I guess this will have to do for now. Now I need a way to make some money. I gotta start rebuilding my life. Oh, I have a perfect idea. Oh, it's so f uh, Excuse me, sir. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, don't sneak up on me like that. Hey, I'm really sorry. Do you remember me, buddy, Chance? I was in your restaurant a little while ago. Oh, yeah, you're that, uh, that one thief, right? No, no, I wasn't the thief. My brother was. Yeah, 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 same difference. Listen, you offered me a job before, and I was wondering if it was still available. Yeah, I mean, we have a very small opening position. Listen, I'll take whatever I can get, okay? I could really use the job. Look, as long as you want to be responsible and not turn to the life of crime, then yeah, you can take the job. Trust me, sir, I'm responsible. I won't let you down. All right, I've got to run these over to table five. Here you go, guys, here are your drinks. Man, this job is exhausting. Who knew being a waiter was so crazy? Oh my god, my order was wrong! Are you serious? Waiter! A uh, waiter! Are you kidding? It's Roger? Roger, what is it now? Waiter, I... Wait a second, Marcus? No wonder why my food is burnt. It's because you're the one that probably cooked it. I'm just a waiter. I didn't cook your food. You know what? I, I demand to see a manager. Manager! Manager! I need you right now! Yeah, what seems to be going on over here? 
uh, Yoweda, he messed up my entire order. Sir, that's not true. Marcus, one second. Uh, I'm so sorry, sir. Um, uh, we'll fix that right away. Uh, I don't want to see this waiter's face for the rest of the day, all right? It's bugging me now. Uh, he messed up my order. It's going to ruin my day. Sir, you can't be listening to him. This is my brother, the guy from before. Look, he's a customer, all right? He has to be right. Marcus, you, you got to go home for the day, man. Oh, just when I thought I could escape him, he comes back into my life again. The worst brother on the planet. I just want my space. I just want peace and quiet. Wait a second. What's going on? Mom? Dad? What's going on? Are you moving? We're on the streets now. We're evicted because of your brother. He spent all of our money, and now we don't have enough to pay for the house. All of this is because of Roger? I told you guys, he was lying the entire time. Don't pin this all on your brother. You're part of this too. If you and your brother just got along, things would be a whole lot different. No. No, I'm sick of getting blamed for everything. This isn't my fault. Roger is the worst person in the world, and you never believed me. You just always went along with him. All of this is on you. I'm not going to sit here and get told how to live my life by a poor person. Honey, let's get out of here. We have to go to the hotel. All right, I'm just going to get home and... No. <laughs> no. Ah, uh, look it. The small things that you had are now just completely gone. Isn't it so funny? No, it's not funny. You are so messed up, man. How could you do this to me? You ruined my house, and you also got mom and dad kicked out of their house. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't matter to me because I'm not affected by it. Stop being so stupid, dude. You better watch your back, Roger. You're gonna get what's coming to you one day. You'll see. <sighs> believe this. Literally everything I was just building up in my life is gone. This is just what he does. Roger comes in and ruins everything. What am I supposed to do now? Whoa, what, what's going on? Sir, what are you doing here? I was coming to check on you. I mean, after I sent you home and everything that happened. Yeah, well, this is my home. Completely destroyed. Well, I can't have a worker of mine living on the streets. Uh, look, uh, there's an extra room at my place. Don't mention it at all, all right? Just, just make sure you're working extra hard. This is amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wait, what's going on over there? Of course he's late yet again. Yeah, man. Can't believe him. I don't even think we should be friends with him anymore. Yeah, I don't either. I'm sick of hanging around poor people all the time. <laughs> I know, and he's so poor. I only want to be friends with people who can do cool stuff, you know? Wait, what? Are they saying all this about me? Uh, nah. Uh, hey guys, uh, sorry I'm late. Yeah, whatever, dude. Are you ready to go shopping? Yeah, seriously, we've been waiting like so long now. Yeah, I actually have a surprise for you guys. I mean, it explains why I'm late, you know? I want to take you guys on a private vacation on a private jet. You can't be serious. No, no, you're bluffing. No, I'm not, and you know, I plan on paying for all of it, the entire trip. Oh my goodness, dude, dude, dude you're like awesome! You're so cool! Uh, yeah, I know I'm cool, right? you don't have to tell me what I already know. Oh man, huh? now I got friends relying on me? Oh no, I need to get money and fast, and I know exactly where to do it. Why not mess with Marcus's life a little bit more? So I'm gonna steal from the restaurant he works at. No one should be here. Yep, completely empty. Oh man, this guy's office smells. Can't believe this is inside of a restaurant. No, the safe is locked. Where's the code? Let me guess, it's gonna be yep, right here, right in the manager's desk. Oh my goodness. This guy does not know what security is at all. This is just too easy. Yep, and it's all the money. Oh god, alright, I'm out of here. Vacation, here I come. Hey, what's going on? I can't believe this, Marcus. We were completely robbed last night. And they took everything, everything. No, no, this is awful. W what are we gonna do? We don't have enough funds to keep this place running. We gotta permanently close it. What? No, no way. We, we can't just close the restaurant. Is there something that I can do? There has to be something. I'm sorry, Marcus, but there isn't. I've got to figure something out. I did save a lot of money, so maybe I can invest it. Maybe I'll start my own restaurant. Dude, look, 
I, I took everything. I got away with all of it. Dude, I can't believe you actually got away with it. Look at this. This has to be like thousands and thousands of dollars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. But it was a piece of cake, all right? I don't mean to pat myself on the back or anything. Seriously, you said that the code to the safe was just on his desk. Dude, it's not like you robbed Fort Knox. Cut me some slack, man. I'm the one that brought us all the money back. You mean you brought me the money back? What, what are you talking about? This is my money now. I'm the one that came up with the idea in the first place. You're really just nothing but a loser, Roger. Hey, don't, don't, don't say that. that Listen, all this money belongs to me now. And if you mention anything to anyone, I'll tell them how you stole it in the first place and I'll get you arrested. You're not going to get away with this, man. I won't let you. Oh, I think I already am. <laughs> Later, loser. Hey! I can't believe this! My one friend! He just left me with nothing? Hey! Hey, Freddy! Yeah, what's going on, man? Dude, uh, uh, Sam! Sam, he took all the money! Wait, isn't that like, exactly what he did to your brother? Shut up, man! That's besides the point, alright? Listen, man, if I'm being honest with you, be being friends with you is like kind of a lot of work. What do you mean by that? I buy you guys so many things. Yeah, but like that was before and then now you just you don't really have any money. Wait, so now that I don't have money, you're just gonna what? You're just gonna leave me behind? Uh, yeah. I just don't want to be friends with you, alright? Can you just leave? You know, whatever. I don't need you. I don't need Sam and I, and I don't need any of this. I'm out of here. I, I choose to leave. I choose to leave. Wow, look at this place. It actually worked. Worked hard, saved my money, and I was able to open my own restaurant. I started from the bottom, and I rebuilt myself up, and now I own my own business. Is this new restaurant yours? Oh, hi, Roger. Yes, this is my restaurant now. You got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. H how in the world did you open up a restaurant? Well, I saved my money, and I worked really hard, and I was able to get this going. Saving money? That, that, that's just stupid. So what, you're just some rich, successful business owner now? I'm not rich yet, but I will be one day. Well, if you're so rich now, then uh, g give me some money then. I'm your brother, man. You're supposed to give me some money. We're family. No, absolutely not. You've never once acted like a real brother to me, Roger. Listen, if you're not going to buy anything in the restaurant, you need to get out. Well, don't worry. I'm leaving anyway. Marcus, a new restaurant owner? No way. He's not supposed to be successful. I am. Huh, I wonder who could that be? Roger? Hey, uh, Marcus. Roger, it's been years. What are you doing here? Look, I know it's been a while. I just, I wanted to come and ask for help. My life has really took a turn for the worst, alright? I know I did a lot of bad things, but I'm, I'm sorry. You're not sorry for anything, Roger. You never have been, and you never will be. Marcus, I really am sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Like, I've grown as a person, and now I just want to better myself. Look, we're brothers, man. Please. Even after everything you've done, it still hurts to see you like this. Listen, you can stay here with me, and you can sleep on the couch. I'll go get you some sheets and get you set up. Oh, man. This is just getting started. Ugh, what is... What is that smell? Is that fire? Oh my gosh, what's going on? Uh, I don't know, it just, it just caught on fire. Roger, what is wrong with you? What are you trying to do, burn my house down? Look, I was just trying to make breakfast for you. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, Ari. Yeah, I'm just trying to make myself useful around here. I understand. I'm sorry, it just was quick to react. Don't worry about it, alright? I have insurance on everything here. Everything will be fine. Yeah, I'm sorry. I mean, I've never cooked before. I've never really dealt with food. Well, you said you wanted to make yourself useful, right? I could really use some help at the restaurant, and I'll pay you. Wait, really? Yeah, but you can't set fire to my restaurant like you almost did my house. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. Uh, I'll take the job. Thank you so much. You know, it actually feels nice. What does? Us getting along, finally being brothers. First, you give me unsweetened tea when I asked for sweet tea. Then you gave me a Caesar salad, and I asked for a house. What's wrong with you? Hey, man, take it easy, all right? Jeez, it's my first day on the job, all right? Cut me some slack. You have absolutely ruined my lunch break, you pathetic loser. Yeah, well, you're ruining my first day. How does that make you feel, huh? You bigger pathetic loser. 
Hey, hey, what's going on here? This stupid idiot over here is yelling at me, trying to tell me how to do my job. Sir, everything is going to be okay. Roger, you need to go take a walk. Yeah, whatever. I hope this guy trips over his stupid salad. Ah, oh, this job is awful. I hate it. Well, 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 look who it is. Hey, Jimmy, I haven't seen you in forever. What are you doing here? I have a special offer for you, Roger. An offer? What are you talking about? Well, I heard that you fell on some hard times. Had you go move in with your brother and actually get a job. <laughs> yeah, but hey, at least now I'm making money. Well, I have a way you can make more money. Yeah, why would I trust you, huh? After what you did to me. Listen, it was strictly business. And I'm coming to you with a new business opportunity. Well, I'm listening. <laughs> good, good. I'm gonna make you an offer you can't refuse. Wait, what? Are you serious? We're gonna do it from here? I don't know about this, man. Just shut up. This is my job, all right? I just need you for the distraction. All right, fine. Uh, I got an idea. Oh my gosh! I cannot believe this! Oh, oh, what's wrong, sir? Are you okay? Oh my goodness, perfectly fine gas station worker. Uh, someone just completely robbed me. Uh, my car! Well, sir, calm down, calm down, okay? What does your car look like? Uh, it's, uh, it's red. Uh, and it has four wheels. It actually turns out I don't even own a car. Uh, sorry about that. I I'm going. <laughs> I told you, look at all this cash. Yeah, yeah, it was all because of me, all right? I actually will admit, you did a really good job as a distraction. You're actually a really good actor. Yeah, yeah, I have it in my blood. Listen, what's where's my cut of the money? Here, take this, you did a good job. Ah, uh, I forgot how much I love doing this. Hey, Roger, listen, I wanted to talk about... What is this? Oh, uh, yeah, I got a second job. You got a second job? How? Look, man, mind your own business, all right? This is my money. You stole this money, didn't you? You came to me and told me that you changed, and then all of a sudden you show up with a huge bag of cash? I don't believe it. You're lying to me again. Whatever, man, look, just leave me alone. Listen, man, I'm hungry, all right? Uh, you got any snacks in here? Marcus, I want you to move out immediately. What? Are you just gonna seriously kick out your brother like that on the streets? You've done nothing in your life but make poor decisions and take advantage of your friends and your family, and I want no part of it anymore. Fine, I'll leave tomorrow then. Can I just please stay the night at least? As my last act as your brother, I'll let you stay the night, but I want you gone first thing in the morning. Yeah, and I told him I wanted him gone. I just can't be around him anymore. I don't know, man. I mean, I think he's still being a little bit too harsh. He told me that he's changed, and clearly he hasn't. He's stealing money again. Look, I don't know what he's doing, all right, but he's trying to improve himself, and that's what really matters. Sure, yeah, he wanted to work and get a job, and he was doing okay for a little bit, but then he just fell back into his old habits. It's hard for people to change, all right? The only thing that matters is that he's trying. It's just hard for me to forget everything that he's done to me. Leaving me on the side of the road multiple times, flipping out on his birthday. He basically got my family to kick me out of the house. But what's important right now is your brother, and it's obvious that he needs your help more than he knows. You're probably right. Maybe I should give him one last chance. Well, Marcus just completely flipped out and kicked me out, huh? Now I got no job, no place to go. Right back where I started. I don't know what I'm gonna do to support myself. I mean, maybe I didn't make the right call. Maybe I should have just kept working and deal with this stupid guy's salad. Whoa, your brother's got a nice place here. <laughs> what do you want? Well, I wanted to come talk to you about another job. You did so good last time, I figured I could use your help again. I don't know. I don't think I should do it anymore. Are you good with being a homeless loser with no money? All right, man, look, you don't have to say it like that. Well, it's true. So here's the deal. Your brother lives in a massive mansion with a ton of expensive stuff. We're gonna steal all of it. I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't think it's right. It's my brother. And plus, I mean, he's got security cameras. We'd get caught. Really? Well, that puts a kink in my plan. We'll just rob the restaurant then. I don't want to rob from him. He's my brother, dude. Like that's mad at before. And look, he's kicking you out. And are you just gonna stand around and let that happen? The Raja I knew would never let that happen. You're right. You know what? I think it's time that we take revenge. Luckily, I've already studied the plans for the security system. Ha, perfect. So we can take all his money. Exactly. Just follow my lead, all right? Here it is. Ha <laughs> ha! He just keeps all the money in here? What an idiot. Look, we gotta hurry up, all right? We gotta take everything inside and go now. Before it's too late. 
Well, I'm sorry, Roger. It is too late. How'd you know I was here? I saw the security footage from the house. I heard everything you said. Well, I'm sorry, all right? I, I need the money. Well, it's too late now. I called the police. And they're already on their way here. What? No! No, 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 no! I can't believe we got ourselves into this. Marcus, please, please, just don't press any charges. Come on, please, let us go. We wasn't gonna do nothing. You both were gonna steal from me. You know what, Marcus? You're right. I deserve this. Marcus, look, I'm sorry, and, and I'm gonna better myself, I promise. Well, I really hope you mean that, Roger. I do. I promise. All right, shut up, everyone. Come on, let's get out of here. You're going to jail. Until next time I see you, Marcus. Until next time, Roger.